I want to know what these look like in game. Let's go ahead and get a random one. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Ooh. Okay, so here's the first thing I want to test. The deagle, that one rare animation where you like go in circles. I want to see what it looks like on it. All right, let's go ahead and jump in the water over here. Let's do a couple of flicks. Oh, dude, right away we got the animation. See, I'm... <laughs> I was very curious to, like... Okay, so it doesn't shake as much as you think it would. I mean, it definitely... It feels like there's, like, a tiny bug at the end of my gun. A little bit. Also, this water's goaded. Look at that, bro. Sorry, not wrong video. Okay, so that's what the bean looks like. Oh, my God, I'm under the water. Hello, how are you? I am under the water. Please help me. You're too much raining. <laughs> okay. Let's do a couple more flicks here. And then maybe we'll try the bean on... Can I, like, play with my inventory right now? Okay, yeah. So, we, we actually... I think we only have a certain amount of charm detachers, but I don't care. I'm doing it for the video. What we can actually do, which is super interesting, is attach the charm to the bomb. Now, I almost, like, want to see what it looks like in-game. Let's go ahead and attach this charm. Okay, there we go. Wait. Where's the charm? Now is the time. What? <laughs> no way! Where's the charm at, dude? Here. No way I put it on the bomb and it's not here. Dude, I got scammed! question can i put it like the tip of my op oh my god i can i can just put it right at the tip i would like like right here i feel like it'd be too disturbing all right let's put it at the tip all right let's go ahead and buy the op <laughs> it looks like it looks like a little piece of like snot is left on my gun bro that's hilarious and it's weird because like the bean was so it looked so big on the deagle and it looks like really small on my op yeah, i'm trying to like yeah it, it's funny kind of how small it actually looks on this one and now i, th I think i should have like put it on like the scope or something okay so i have one more detachment available okay so now can i not detach it now okay so this this is like the real placement for this one so i can't screw this one up okay so you can't put it on the revolver yeah you can't put it on the spinny part which would make sense because i was wondering i'm like how would that even work i'm trying to find anywhere that i could place it that's like broken can i place it okay i can't place it on the strap can i place it on the silencer wait so you can place it on the side so then you could just get rid of the bean by taking off the silencer Okay, so now if I take this off, it doesn't drop, right? No, it doesn't. Oh, you know what is a question? If I re-silence... Hold on, this this is groundbreaking here. If I re-silence it, does it put the bean back on? Okay, let's test it out. Okay, so now let's go back. Let's see, if we silence and then unsilence, what happens? Okay, secondary fire. Okay, so we take the... Oh, look, it rotates with it. That's so sick. Okay, so what happens if we put it back on? Okay, so the game actually remembers that I have a bean on. Also, oh, keep calling it bean, but it, I, I mean charm. That's, that's actually kind of cool how it rotates with it, though. I mess with that. There it is, okay. So, uh, this, I think this could be interesting. Let me place it on this part of the Galil. Yeah, I'm, I'm like totally wasting this charm, but dude, I don't even care. All right, let's pull out the Galil. Yeah, I'm, I'm very curious to see what it does when we're shooting. Because you guys know that the Galil, that thing goes crazy. That's a little funny, actually. Because I feel like that, that's like, this is one of the more unique spots you could put it for it to do funny things. Okay, I might actually leave it here. That might be like my favorite place to put it because it's kind of right up front I feel like this isn't like crazy disturbing. It like kind of like hangs on your hand What about when it reloads hold on Cuz like look doesn't he touch 
Yeah, he kind of like grabs it when he reloads too. So what happens now if we detach? Okay, so now I need to buy a detachment pack. Okay. So let me go ahead and detach it. So that's a that's a little weird. Oh, and you know what's the one thing I didn't check? What ha what happens to the charm if I have no more detaches? Do I, does it just get trashed? I guess, I mean, this is all part of experimenting. Let's take a look. All right, let me try to find some other, like, weird places that I can put it. Okay, hold on. This is one thing I'm very curious. Can I have infinite beans by putting it on, like, a magazine? So, like, if I put it on the bison right here... Wait, can I... Does it not... It won't actually let me put it on the bison mag. Okay. But it'll let me do it on something like an AK mag, right? Yeah, like I can put... No. Okay, that's super interesting to note. You cannot put the charm on any magazines. Okay. Let me let me try something. Like what about um, like a CZ? Again, you can't put it on the mag itself. So you can put the bean on the back of the Zeus. That completely blocks. Oh, also, this is hilarious. That Zeus can be holding the bean. Okay, that might that might be like a pretty goaded spot to put it. He's just straight holding it. You know what's another thing I'm very curious about? How many beans can you put? Question. Can I put it? Oh my so it's the same thing with the tech. Where you can kind of put it on the part that moves. Okay, so that might be one of the more interesting places to put it. Is on Galil's and Tech 9's. Like, let me take a look at my actual tech. Like, I feel like that'd actually be kind of a cool place to put it. Okay, so according to CSGO skins, only a single charm can be attached at one time. So that that's good to know. Okay, everybody, I'm going to put the game and I just so happen to pick this gun up. That's a cool charm. All right, so there we go. That is the That's golden mac. Oh. All right, everybody. It's a little while later. You can see my rank has definitely changed. We can go ahead and grab another bean. Do I want another bean or do I want one of these? I think I want a bean. I can't tell like which one would be more expensive. You know what? Let's just get one of these just so we get one of both. Oh, nah, it's just a blue. Okay. Well, now we have two to play with. So this makes it interesting. Can I, Again, this will tell us if we can put two on. Now, there are a couple more positions that I would love to try on guns. Mainly, this is one that I was thinking of on the op. I can put it on this little switch thingy, right? This thing goes back when you go like, right? Let's put it right there. And I'm curious to see what that does. And this will also tell us. Okay. It's confirmed only one charm per gun. All right, let's go ahead and see what that looks like, though, in-game. Okay, yeah, so, look, when you shoot, it actually does come with it, too. Honestly, I'm I'm actually kind of a fan of this spot. I think on the off, that is definitely the best spot to put it right there. It, it gives it a little bit of movement, too. And again, it's not super distracting. It's kind of low-key. All right, yeah, that, that's definitely the spot there. So technically, you could put it on the AUG right here, and that'll be, like, pretty similar to the Galil. The other place you could put it is on a Glock. Where are my Glocks? You could put it on the back of the Glock, and I think that would also be pretty cool. Yeah, let me put this one on the back of my Glock. Let me see what that looks like. Okay, and see, and it, this is weird because it kind of like hangs onto your arm the whole time, which is kind of funny. Okay, it doesn't actually move as much as I thought it would. But I actually, I kind of mess with it just like dangling on your hands there. That's kind of interesting. All right, so now that, uh, wait, is there any like cool inspects? No. Oh, it is a little weird that it kind of like hangs off of your hand, though, like not on your hand. It's like a weird floaty. You see right there? All right, let me see. Now, let me take, go ahead and take this uh, detached charm. So I have four detaches. Oh, because, okay. Because I bought, I got another charm. 
I'm assuming every time I get a charm, you get three more detaches. Okay, hold on. Huh? Okay, this one apparently doesn't move. Okay, good to know. That one does not actually move. Let's go ahead and detach that charm from there. It would be cool if you could add two charms on this gun. And again, I think I think it'd be super sick if you could put like two on this one, one in both hands. I think that'd be kind of sick. Okay, I guess this is the other one we could try. Why don't we see how it looks like on a scout? Oh, of course, dude, I put it on the wrong scout again. All right, it's fine. Whatever. We'll just uh do a little bit of that. Am I Okay, there we go. See, that's kind of cool, too. I think that's a little less cool than the op, but... All right, how many more detaches do we got? I got two more detachments. Okay, so we... And again, I know I'm, like, completely wasting these. I don't really mind. I'm just trying to figure out what happens once I'm out of detaches. You know what? I actually... I am very curious to see what it looks like in his hand here. Let's go ahead and attach that. My problem is... Okay, there we go. I could just buy it. There we go. Okay, it's... It's honestly not as cool as I thought it'd be. I think I'm gonna leave it here on the AK. Like, down here is pretty... Let's see what that looks like. I think that's, like, it's fairly nonchalant, and I kind of like that. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of chill. Let me see. So, can I detach it again? Okay. So, this is the one problem. You actually can't take it off your gun at all. So if you run out of attachments, that's kind of GG. I thought I could still take it off, but it would just destroy it. No, it's stuck. It is stuck on your gun unless you pay a dollar. Okay. Okay, everybody. Um, I hope you guys liked that. Maybe it gave you some good ideas on where you want to put your charms. But yeah. See ya.